Hi, this is Paul Davids with another 10 awesome fingerstyle songs for guitar. As I mentioned before in another fingerstyle video, these lists barely scratch the surface of the awesome fingerstyle songs there are to play. But to scratch the surface some more, here are 10 more songs to play. But this time I call it awesome song instead of fun songs. Because a part 2 is always worse than the original and I don't want that for this video. In this video we see some basic songs as well as some very difficult ones. To build it up a little bit, let's start with a moderate easy one. Eddie Vedder, guaranteed. From the soundtrack of the movie Into the Wild, this song features a very basic finger picking pattern you definitely should know. The one thing that could make the song very difficult is that some of these shapes aren't using open strings, so make the chord changes sound fluently can be difficult. Number two on the list is Simon and Garfunkel, The Boxer. It doesn't get more classic than this. I knew this song, but playing it again made me realize how beautiful this song really is. The brilliant melody is long with the folky guitar playing, it's just of a high level, seldomly seen after. Okay, still talking about classic, the next one is Big Love by Fleetwood Mac, but for this video I chose the live version of Lindsey Buckingham. Please check him out performing that song live, it's mind dropping. I must say, the guitar part looks harder than it is, so definitely give it a try. Up next, Heart of Life, John Mayer. Yes, again. Once a fanboy. Well, this song is just so fun to play. The classic John Mayer picking with a melody added on top. I made a video tutorial about his picking patterns, so please check it out if you haven't seen that already. And now for some more modern songs, Gavin James with Nervous. This is a great song with some beautiful melodies chucked away in some very basic chords. A good showcase of how to spice up your basic chords and picking patterns.
for the next song I'm changing to a different guitar because that song is played in an open G tuning which means if I play all the strings open I hear a G chord over D. It's Troubles Will Be Gone from The Tallest Man on Earth. It's played very fast with a lot of changes and remembering this song took me quite some time. Nevertheless, once you've got the shapes down, the song isn't that hard. If you're used to picking at the speed of light. Next up, Mark Knopfler. Just Mark Knopfler, what a champ. This song is Romeo and Juliet. Weirdly enough, this song took me quite some time to get down. I don't know why, the timing is odd. Sometimes it plays in straight feel, sometimes in shuffle feel. It changes it up a little bit. Anyhow, it's a brilliant picking pattern, played with beautiful chords, also in an open G tuning. Next up is the band Wilco with One Sunday Morning. A nice and mellow piece with some sweet transitions going on between the chords. Basically it's just an F, a C and a G. But he spices them up a little bit and gives them that Jeff Tweedy character. Originally this track is played one step down. Next up, Led Zeppelin, Babe I'm Gonna Leave You. I just had to throw this song in, so many requests. Played in the key of A minor with a descending bass line going from A to G to F sharp to F and E. With some very nice embellishments on top. A very good finger exercise for as well your left as your right hand. Or for the lefties, your right and your left hand. Last up we've got Sting with the song Fragile. The melody of this song is played in sixths, meaning that between the lowest and the highest notes there is always a sixth interval, a major or a minor sixth. It's a technique that is often used, it often results in beautiful harmonies, as you can see in this beautiful song. Thank you. 
right, those were our 10 songs, and I want to give a big shout out to everyone supporting me on Patreon. They are the reason I can do what I do, put so much time and effort in these videos. And by supporting me, they help me acquire some gear for making these videos, like the light, the camera, the microphone I'm talking in, the microphone that's recording into, some stuff that made making these videos a lot easier than before. Thanks for that. So if you like what I do, maybe consider joining the Patreon page as well. Or just subscribe to my channel or drop a like, a comment or share this video. And I hope to see you again in another video. This was Paul Davids, have a great day, goodbye.